behalf of the IHSAA, please join us in saying thank you to the Indiana Fever and the Indiana Pacers for their generous support of student athletes in high school basketball in Indiana. After we announce the name of the recipient, we invite her parents to join her on the arena floor. The recipient of this award was selected by the IHSAA Executive Committee. The student was nominated by her principal and coach and excelled in mental attitude, athletic ability, scholarship, and leadership. The winner of the 2023 Patricia L. Roy Mental Attitude Award for Class 2A Girls Basketball is Amber Treader of Forest Park High School. Amber is the uh, second consecutive Rangers player to win this award. Last year, Grace Fleck won it. And uh, if you go back to 2000, Lisa Hoppenjads also picked up the Medal Attitude Award. All told, the school has five Medal Attitude wow. Awards. Uh, expected to graduate as valedictorian of her graduating class this spring. Serves as the secretary of Forest Park's branch of the National Honor Society. Four-year member of the basketball team of the track and field team. Also spent three years with the marching band. She is the daughter of Matt and Heather Treader of Ferdinand, Indiana. What a great honor for no her. No doubt about it. I'll tell you, listen, another double-double. 13 points, 12 rebounds. Just a great game. Three assists as well. This, by the way, was the fifth overall state championship for Forest Park. Second, of course, in girls basketball. They won two in boys basketball and one in softball. So that little school way down south is doing quite well. Let's head down uh, out of the court again. Here's Allison with our Middle Attitude Award winner. I can see it all over your face. This means so much to you and to your team. Can you put into words what being a member of this team has meant to you? It's just an unbelievable experience, and to do all these, this history and make all this history with this team is, um, I want to replace it with anything. The, my teammates are amazing. They're always behind my back. Every day they're pushing us in practice, and it's just an amazing experience to do this with them. When we talk about leadership, we see it on the court, but also for you throughout your community. Why is that important to you to be a leader both on and off the court? Um, I grew up in a good family with good parents and a great community too and it's just um, amazing and we all try to um, be with each other and um, always support each other and we just always make sure that we do that on and off the court um, in every atmosphere. We've got mom and dad here too and, and can you tell us about your daughter, maybe a little something that makes her special that you weren't surprised here today? I just think, you know, she's been blessed with a lot of gifts. God's given her a lot of gifts. And, um, and I, you know, I'm proud the way that she uses those to love and serve him. And I think she's a, a humble and a, a compassionate person. And she tries to do everything she can to make a difference in others' lives. Well, congratulations to all of you and to Forest Park. Dan, a quick check on the uh, scoring first off for LaPelle. They only had one player in double figures.